ready for the final act of today and the conference. Um, I welcome you all back after lunch. Um, very excited to present you the um, last block of this conference and of, of today. Um, we labeled it Specialized Debt Strategies and uh, at the end, the investor panel. Um, we're going to start out with a presentation which is going to be live stream. I think um, Dan and Joe should already be um, ready to go. Um, Dan Dierkin, um, as president of NECREF, the National Council of Real Estate Investment Fiduciaries, and Joe D'Alessandro, director of private real estate performance measurement at NECREF, um, will present us with something that I and I think a lot of you have been confronted with um, for for many years now with investors, managers asking, is there a benchmark for real estate debt? Um, is there something we can um, use as a proxy when we try to understand the asset class, when we're modeling the asset class in our ALM and SAA an an analysis? And um, there's really not much out there, but I'm very excited to say that there is an organization in the US, and I think the US has always been um, front runner in, in creating transparency, working exactly on that type of index. Um, so, without further ado, I'm going to turn it over to the U.S. Live stream, thank you for waking up early, being with us. Uh, Dan and Joe, I see you here and here. The stage is yours. Beautiful. Thank you, David, and uh, thanks for having us. We appreciate the opportunity to, uh, to be invited. Certainly wish we could be there with you, but we'll, we'll figure that out as, as the uh, years progress. So uh, my name is Dan Deerking, I'm president of NACREF, and I'll be joined by Joe D'Alessandro. We're going to walk you through an initiative that we've been working on for a little bit on creating a, a real estate debt fund index. So as I click, there we go. So when we start to think, why, why a debt fund index? Right, and, and, and NACRI's been dealing in the equity space for 40 years, so, so why, why a debt? Why, why get involved? The truth of the matter is, you gotta look at the size of the industry. And we, and we pulled this information uh, with the help from Priya and CREFC. There's over 4.7 trillion in outstanding US commercial loans. And there's, there's no benchmark today to help with performance measurement. As you look at that 4.7, 6.5 trillion of that, um, or, Yes, 6.5 is, um, is, is total debt. And then, I'm sorry, I'm, I'm screwing all this up with my numbers. Private debt is 3.2, and then 1.5 is in the public side of things. So 